Oh, I didn't if you pay. stop at fifty, I mean that's a no brainer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're doing you all right. Yeah, you got to take that. It's, it's a a no the plot brainer. from Interview with the Vampire, right? It's yeah. the same shit. Yeah, good you're, movie. You're basically a vampire. Yeah. yeah. But you don't drink blood. Not man, that was a deep ass question. Yeah, it was. Yeah, that man. really it was rattled dark. me. Start a whole new podcast. <laughs> I'm be thinking about that on the plane. That grocery for sure. store bagger really got me. <laughs> <laughs> you ever met this guy? Oh, I'm the dumb one. You can't argue. There's something about me. You have no idea what you're saying. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz. Sure. Oh, I'm in town. I'm doing sets in LA. You know how it works, Daddy? Yeah, you know no, my I'm schedule, bro. Trying to figure it out. Yeah. You know my schedule, dog. I know your schedule a lot. But we have a lot of the same schedule. You know, dude. If you're, if you're, if stuff. your uh, wedding is in two weeks, yeah, you're doing show tomorrow, right? But you're gonna do it. Right, 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 right. right. I am. I, yeah. I actually talked to oh, her and I decided. Thank you. Yeah, no, you know, no you know problem. I can. <laughs> All right, dude. I'll do the show. Also, um, what, we bro? got these dudes. They're on it. Everyone knows who they are. They're I know what I'm famous saying. Than us. Let them fucking. <laughs> these guys are blowing up. I understand. Are we, we're starting it. God damn it! I don't know how show business works. <laughs> Just make sure. You know what I mean? show argument. I like yeah. that. Make sure everybody's fucking comfortable and we're all ready to go. Yeah, we're good. Everyone has drinkies. You got good, Diet baby. Coke. I got a you got screaming sweet. cold Diet Coke yeah. over here. I'm set. And yeah. I want to say, as a fat guy who's done a bunch of pods where it's not, well, the guest doesn't have a desk, I appreciate this couch. Couch yeah. is nice. I can slide it back a little bit. It's nice. <laughs> yeah, Those people, jets and chairs. I mean, our me. fan base is going to be familiar with you, but if they're not, these are two of my favorite human beings in comedy. It's oh, from thank the, you. the Thanks, pod, buddy. Are You Garbage? Yeah. The most unique podcast in all the land. Appreciate the rest that. was just bullshit. But you guys actually have a <laughs> kind of a thing to do on Even your show. Even when he compliments us, he's scary. I know. <laughs> so yeah. he does it. But it's it's Foley and Kevin from Are You Garbage Man, all the way from New York. Thanks yes, for having sir. us, Thanks, man. Thanks, buddy. Thanks for having us. This is the first time meeting Chris? Yeah. 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 You know what's crazy is whenever I meet, because I'm from New Jersey, and like whenever I meet I always forget that. people <laughs> with like your energy I'm, sure I, I feel so good like i feel so <laughs> like oh yeah these people because like you guys are obviously from the fucking east coast oh yeah. my no, god yeah. look at the way they can't talk. Hide it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but like salt lake city utah four yeah. <laughs> <laughs> miles like, <laughs> it's like witness protection yeah but um what well, is name miller yeah 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 but uh <laughs> it's just uh not I, I i love it like whenever i meet i'm like oh yeah fuck that's right yep that's a whole area because in la you don't really you don't you don't run into guys with this vibe. You really don't. No, guys never. over 200 pounds, you can say it. <laughs> no, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah. You can fucking guys say it, have, <laughs> Guys who don't have body dysmorphia. Yeah, that's I, know, LA, I haven't seen two guys as ugly as you. <laughs> yeah. like no, no, no. It's, it's, it's refreshing. Chris is like, we need you guys here more, man. You guys are ugly. Yeah. yeah, I mean your voices and your cadence and your fucking, your, your energy. You know I mean? <laughs> 100%. And the, the reason I love these guys, when I did their it's pod, like, I, I was aware because Tim Timmy Dillon, mm -hmm. who's a mutual friend of ours, did mm -hmm. your pod and then when i was going to la to, or i'm sorry going to new york to do all the promo uh for my special the every com every big comic every comic in new york was like mm. you have to do all your garbage mm. every every mm. single one i was like and you know i'm you know you never know people are fucking weird but and i was like oh are they cool and everyone's like the best yeah they haven't they haven't gone yeah been able hollywood. to trick everybody so yes. far you know so yeah, it's, it's going well yeah. Yeah. hollywood we can't go hollywood you kid i can't go jersey what are you nuts yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> You guys are getting there though, man. We're Things, are, Things are going well. We had, a, you know, we took an Escalade here. Yeah, yeah sure. Nice. I was, was going to send you car service. service. I know, <laughs> but that's also like how trashy I am. I'm like, I can't. He's going to send car service. I can't do that. Yeah, you're like, no, man. We'll just Uber. I'm yeah, like, no, please. We'll you're helping Dude, us. Don't worry. Out. We'll walk. I'll yeah. take, we'll does the L train limo. run out here? I'll take yeah. that. We pull up in a limo. We're both sitting in the front seat. <laughs> <laughs> Couple of rookies. The drivers in the back. You take a load off. You're stressing me out. You relax back there. Don't worry. I brought my pass. Passport. That's how I didn't know where we were going. <laughs> yeah, he really, dude. You said Calabasas. I'm thinking this is going to be clutter. There are going to be security gates and this, that, and the Calabasas other. Calabasas sounds exotic. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Then we rolled by a 7 Eleven. I was like, okay. Uh, right. Yeah, that's yeah, where yeah, I get my big gulp. <laughs> get my big that's gulp. That's you know, I'm garbage. I get a big gulp every single day, man. I like how you have three drinks, too. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> dude, Theo, who's not here today, uh, shout out to Theo. He called me. You know, I mean, it's one legit concern because yesterday, you know, when I do my shows, I drink, man. I just sure. like to have a good time. He's like, dude, I, I know we joke over, uh, joke around about intervention, stuff mm -hmm. like that. He's like, but for you, he's dead serious. And this is coming from Theo. He goes, but for you to drink on most of the shows, yeah. it's concerning. 
And he goes, because I've been, I've been there, man. Yeah. You're drinking to get through it because you hate it. Mm. I was like, oh, no, no. You, yeah. got, you no, don't well, you love it. I absolutely love he, it. He this is the highlight of my day. <laughs> yeah, I absolutely love it, dude. Yeah. I have a drink to celebrate. Yeah, That's yeah. where we're different. Either what do way. you do with the rest of the day, though? Like, have you already, I assume you worked out this morning, right? Worked out, Bro, yeah. you, you wake up. You wake up too early. It's 5 30. It's too Whoa. early. Sleep later than that. Sleep later than that. Yeah. Sleep later than that. I know. You yeah, even tired. with kids, make them sleep later. Though, yeah? You look more tired than me, you get eight hours. I feel, I feel great, bro. And also, the key is I'm not drinking. That's the key. <laughs> yeah. The key is I'm just, I got my coffee, I got my water, I'm chilling, right? Yeah, I'm a yeah, drink I'm behind because you got three. You got a Diet Coke, a coffee. Hydrated. <laughs> it's yeah. crazy. This guy's right? all it's over crazy. the map, dude. <laughs> He's three different guys. I didn't realize the three drinks you do have. This is eight shots of espresso. Unbelievable. That's insane. This is a Diet Coke. And then that's type you're just of thing. redlining constantly. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got three shows. And you there. don't. And you don't really. Well, you go to bed early a lot though. Sometimes. Yeah. If I'm not doing sets, right, I'm right. in bed about nine when? thirty. Nine thirty. Dude, Kristen told she was like, "Please come into bed early tonight and just sleep." And I was like, "I don't want to." I said we were. I was like, "Let's watch murder shows." You know, you watch murder documentaries. Mm-hmm. Everybody's fucking murder documentaries. Yeah, yeah. We're talking like like actual docs. Or we're talking no Christopher like- Dunch. You know the fucking uh, surgeon who th- they made a show about it. Doctor Death. Joshua Jackson plays it. But yes. then I watched the whole fucking thing. I heard the podcast already. I watched the whole fucking thing on Doctor Death. And then at the end, it was like, y- "Would you also like the real documentary about it?" And I'm oh, like, "Yeah, show me the fucking documentary first. Yeah. I gotta watch Joshua Jackson of do course. the fucking thing. Yeah. I, I watch all eight shit. episodes, and oh. now I gotta watch. Now I want to see." the real thing i fucking would have never watched joshua jackson but you're a night owl you're a right nice so doctor. she was she was like let's watch murder shows there's a christopher dunch thing on she's like okay she comes down and then like after 10 minutes she's like i'm gonna go back upstairs i'm like you fucking trick me i'm i'm so involved yeah i have so, to finish it dude she goes up she's like please just this one time go up come upstairs and watch with me but what's early 11 yeah why can't you watch it up in the you got the tv up in the room right i tell you what dude. 11 what are you a vampire i tell you what man <laughs> What? Here's 11? What, what are you, Steve Aoki? <laughs> what are you, a DJ? What, I'll sleep when I'm dead. I'll yeah. sleep when I'm dead. 12 yeah. Well, no, but like. He did. He three hours of sleep. Don't stop. No, I sleep. Stop. I sleep long enough, but I just go to sleep late. But anyway, but this is getting derailed. My point is, <laughs> I, 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 the bed is for sleeping and, and fucking. mostly just sleeping, but, but fucking. fucking. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes. But like, I don't want to like, she, like, she wants to like, she orders food. She's like, can we eat in the bed? I'm uh, like, fuck no. She's like got that? like. Nah, I that's figured crazy. you have a fatty. That's what I thought you guys all did out here. Y'all laid in like huge triple king size bed and yeah. ate burritos. Yeah, you'd be right. I, yeah. With like I white mean, comforters <laughs> yeah. and pillows like, everywhere. Like fish that's, his, that's his idea of success. And, as yeah. well. and paintings I'm in a of huge yourselves. bed, multiple burritos. <laughs> <laughs> Sleeping in like a huge painting of your, of your headshot. <laughs> That sounds nice, <laughs> but but I don't want to like I don't know I I, ve- I very much delineate what I plus we have like a great room downstairs and I'm like so I'm like all right I'll do it so I go up and we it's eleven this is early for me to be in bed so I go up we start watching the thing and I pass the fuck out and then I wake up the next morning and she dude she's already looking at me and she's like we got nine hours of sleep <laughs> and I'm like I didn't want this yeah and then I say you're to her fucked now I know I you're know fucked. I know it's gonna get earlier and earlier I know dude, next I thing know. you know you're eating dinner at three o'clock I know you're in bed by six I know the grays start really coming <laughs> yeah. in it's over good it's matinees over. and shit at the movie theater are you you guys have uh, ladies married yeah. yeah I'm married married yeah. kiddos no, not yet. We got married right before the pandemic. You guys like, are young. How, how young? How old I'm 36. Are you? I'm 46. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You're 46. Uh, you look young. You guys yeah. literally look, yeah, the same age. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You, you, That's you what the, I've heard. The, I've seen 46. the YouTube comments. Yeah, they, they agree with you as well. <laughs> no, no, no. I mean, I, they look, you, He's he looks your age. Fat. Yeah. <laughs> it's the perfect, it's the perfect combination. Uh, maybe I'm just off. I don't know. But uh, you guys look like 28, 30, right? You're I would say, nuts. I would say young. I would say early 30s. I've no also bullshit, been drinking yeah. since age. Yeah, exactly. This guy's on 15 shots of espresso. But that's incredible. Hey, you look really good. Man, you ever put a little rouge on? <laughs> you yeah, try stuff? this dress on. Get over You're here. You're in Calabasas, you man. <laughs> it's not gay out here, dude. <laughs> but no Jalen no Jennings or anything. I got a couple grays. But a couple though. I got more. He's got a thing. great head of hair too. That it, really, yeah, that, that really does, sells right? him. He's you, got a great. You, you head have head my brother's hair. Of, I, I, the pandemic, dude. Yeah. I was like holding tight till the really? pandemic, the and pandemic? then it all went. What are you talking? Dude, about? It was look at the old I was doing all right. Keeps.com promo code shop. It might help. Yep. Yeah. I, I'm on it, dude. I'm on I'm on the fucking I'm on the I'm on the uh 
minoxidil, mm -hmm. and then I do air support, do the pill. That's what I call is like it. The, is it not helping? I call support. that the air support. Yeah, bring, it, bring in the air call support. Call the heavy artillery, Couple dude. Give me the strikes. drugs. How long you been on it? Years. What I started it, uh, in like my uh, early tw mid twenties. It started like I started getting the runways is it a bit. Finasteros. Finasteride. Finasteride. I always forget what it's called, and I, and I take it. Yeah. Because just in case. You take it? I've been taking it because they're like you got to take it. I'm like, really? All right, I'll you take do? It. Wow, that's why. Yeah, that's good though. Like, like if you, you I should have started. Got it. Early. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, I met his dad the other day. The laugh actor. And his dad. Fuck you. How would was you? Seventy four. Yeah. He's seventy four. Yeah, yeah. Full, yeah. Lock, full thing. all silver fox. Yeah. Just Love down to here. Fox. That's a man yeah. who appreciates his hair. He doesn't want to lose it. Yeah. Did yeah. you lose it, career? Yeah, maybe. Right. That's why I'm happy. We got successful man. like this year. I I'm like, I'm, I'm married. <laughs> start to make a couple of bucks. I'm like, everybody can suck my yeah. dick. Yeah, yeah. Dude, I'm chilling. Dude, baby. I love that. <laughs> it'd be it'd be sweet once you make like a million bucks. Just sh go bald, dude. Full base. Dana oh, I got a couple of two years left until I got a really. It's weird when guys down. hang on to it. Some guys, but but some. Like here's my, the thing. Can I say this? Yeah, though? please. And, and yeah, with your luxurious fucking <laughs> well, hair. Yeah, please, please tell me. Here. I'm also, <laughs> yeah. I'm also 900 pounds. I have my crosses to bear. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, you're 450. Okay, I, I'm not saying this because I love you. It works, and it. The, the, you say, you said, why don't they just uh, buzz it? Bruce Willis rocked that for fucking yeah fucking twenty five. I'm, I'm just gonna keep this is long for me. I'm just gonna keep going shorter and shorter and shorter. Mm. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. There are yeah, guys. Listen, I love you. Not Bruce Willis, the horrible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I'm not diehard. Fuck seven. this dude up. This, guy, this guy's talking crazy. <laughs> Tough guy, huh? Fuck. Dude, I don't get like uh, my boy Brian Callen struggles with his hair. I'm like, dude, get a wig. It's 2022. <laughs> dude, a long one, a long one. <laughs> yeah, like a, like a single one. His wig, still. dude. His works. Still. It doesn't, though. If you get close, it looks like a baby ostrich. But what, <laughs> I, but what I think about, like, Brian's got a good head. Like he could yes. just go bald yeah, and he looks fine. Yeah. I really got a horrible head, bro. My Russian baby. <laughs> yeah, you would be a tough oh look. I feel. God, I look like Mr. Oh. Burns. You know, I look like Mr. Burns. Oh, hundred percent, dude. You look. I start. I even yeah. start like doing this. Start like, calling him Smithers and shit. <laughs> yeah, oh, my dude. God. Oh my god. Oh, forget it, dude. Oh my god. Yeah, no, but I always say the pieces of me are very ugly. But when you throw them all together, together? somehow it works, dude. <laughs> yeah, I don't wow, know what that's, it is. That's, yeah, that's but the good. pieces, bro, <laughs> you take my nose. <laughs> nobody nobody being born would be like, ooh, that's the nose I want. Sure. Yeah. That's the mouth. That's the eyes or the nah. Hey Chris, I know dude, if fans are enjoying this episode with Are You Garbage Boys. It's a great episode. It's good. It ain't Patreon, Daddy. No, it's not. And last time on our Patreon, patreon.com slash cats plus P L U S, uh, we uh had our brothers on. We had our brothers on, and Theo was on, and then Theo will also be on the next Patreon version. The um, gang is back, Yeah, dude. the gang's back. Um, we try to make sure Theo's on all the Patreons. So you the know? Patreon's popping, man. Patreon.com slash Cats Plus, and uh, sign up. You also get the, uh, if you sign up now, you get all the other Patreon-exclusive episodes that we have backlogged. And then you also get all the free episodes ad-free, dude. Mm -hmm. It's Some say it's the best Patreon ever. Well, we certainly do. You and I do. We do, yeah, and uh, more, well, and you know we're trying to make it so it's more bang for your buck. That's yes. really what it is. A lot of content, dude. Get the Patreon. All right, let's take a little break from chat with our boys from Are You Garbage, Chris? Because, dude, you and I don't have this problem. We really don't. But two out of three bros will experience some form of hair loss by the time they're 30, 35. 35, yeah. yeah dude. There's more than 50 million men in the U.S. that suffer from male pattern baldness. That's 50? 50 mil, 50 dude. Million male a lot of baldness. bros yeah. losing their hair. And that's why our friends at Keeps offers a simple, affordable, stress-free way to keep your hair. 24-7 care and support. You meet with a doctor virtually, all right? It's low cost. Treatments start at just $10 a month. Oh, okay, see, I would think that that would be $14,000 a month. It's fair. That's Are a you fair saying, price. what was it, 10 $10 a month, Unbelievable. dude. Affordable. Yes, Keeps has everything your hair needs delivered straight to your door. Discreet little package. Nobody has to know you're doing this. Proven results. Mm. Remember, prevention is prevention. key. Prevention, yeah, that's yes. the thing. That's what I do. Yes, yeah. daddy. Yeah. Treatment can take four to six months to see results, so act right now. If you're ready, take action and prevent hair loss. Go to keeps.com slash cats to receive your first month of treatment for free. That's keeps.com slash cats to get your first month free. K E E P S dot com slash K A T S. Chris, I know you're a big UFC fan, dude. Yeah, I like the UFC. I've been getting into it. You know and what's been helping? DraftKings. Oh, because you're making money while you're watching. Yeah, dude. it's like watching passively is nice, but why not make a little coin? God, you're so right, Daddy. And listen, UFC 275 is this Saturday, and our friends at DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of the UFC, has a heavyweight offer this weekend's 
fights with a special parlay for all the listeners and viewers of King of the Sting. They took my picks. My picks are Yuri, Shevchenko, and Wele. All right? You bet the three of them. You do a parlay. They boost your odds, bro. They boost your odds. Just head to the app right now under the UFC page to check out the shop picks. Bet on it and ride along with your thick friend here. Right now, all customers can place the same game parlay for Saturday's fight. And if it hits, you double your winnings, dude. Download the DraftKings Sportsbook app right now. Use promo code KATS. New customers can throw down $5 on UFC 275 and get $150 in free bets instantly. Free money, dude. Dude, that's, free, dude. That's code CATS, K-A-T-S, this Saturday at DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of UFC. Minimum age and eligibility restrictions apply. See show notes for details. Do you guys, you guys feel with now you're getting more successful? Any pressure to look a certain way, change your vibes? Well, we... It's a good question. I'll not, I mean, we were also, like, very... Poor. I think like I made like nineteen thousand dollars in like you know twenty twenty or whatever. But was your wife balling? She was doing all right. She was definitely paying the bill. What's like, she do? Uh, she just works in marketing. Oh, okay, yeah, cool. yeah. But job. she has a um, legit job. She has a legit so job. All right. So like she was like paying the bills and everything. Awesome. Uh, and then yeah, we kind of. She actually gave us the money to open the studio because I was like, I didn't have the money. And I was going to get it from a, my boy who's a Dominican loan shark. Hell yeah. And he was like, I want ten percent of of it moving forward. <laughs> And I was like, all right, I'm going to do it. And my wife's like, take the money. Yeah. And I was Charges like, 20%. all right. Yeah, she's, she's nine and a half, so I'm saving Dude, what are you doing? Take mine. trying to think 20%. of what sounds like a shadier deal, the Dominican fucking <laughs> love truck, or your wife. I know. No. Yeah, we currently have the Yakuza looking for yeah. us. Yeah. But, I'm, dude, looking back, I would that guy, would my buddy would have been making... I would have owed him 10% wow. of RU Garbage. Sounds like a smart Moving guy. forward. Yeah, sounds and like a smart guy. And that's not a guy you cross either, Dominican no. loan no, shark. No, no. Dominican in New York? No, dude. No, no, no. But then oh, wow. your your wife believed in the uh, she did the whole she was journey. like I think it's fun and like we were starting to cook a little bit you know get some traction and then she was like just fucking take the money and open up the studio and then how's how's the road life now you guys because it usually starts with you know you guys got passed at the cellar and stuff like and how, that wait hold on how long you guys been doing stand up like hard fourteen um, years yeah I'm probably like twelve so you so, say 15? so this 14. is the thing fourteen so this is the thing like obviously I know you guys are stand ups but the to to have that under your belt. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You have and this skill set. blow up. Yeah. Dude, it's so killer, dude. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's fucking awesome. I'm happy for you guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. Oh, dude. That's what we get. Like, because our live shows, we don't do live pods. We'll go out and like me and him co-headline and then we close out the last like 20, 25 minutes together like dicking around with oh, the crowd. Awesome, they ask dude. us their garbage questions. That's perfect because live shit pods on them. suck. Cock. Yeah, live pods. Schultz actually told me, Schultz is like, I'm like, yeah, we're going to do live pods. He's like, uh -uh. live pods are for people who can't do stand up. He's like, you're fucking New York City Schultz, comic. That, that's Boom. true. Yeah, do stand up. That's true, yeah. 100%. Yeah. Um, and we can't compare it to, you know, we, don't we, we did minor road things. Before, yeah, it was like a road feature. For, a little bit. Like, you know. And I, may, I mainly worked in the city hosting. Uh, and we can't really compare to what it was like to go out by ourselves, but going out together, it's fucking. The, the experience it's awesome, you guys are boys. We bring our boy to open, our two boys to dude, open, guys, our producer, and how, we just roll as a crew. It. No, it's exciting. That's why I'm like, enjoy I, this. I know, you, I know very you work hard and you've worked hard, but fucking goddamn it, like it's like what's that fucking saying where luck meets preparation or what the fuck? No, you know luck what? is preparation and. It's fucking something. Uh, whatever the Time fuck it is. Something. This is yeah. it, dude. You know what yeah. I mean? It's like, and, and then it took the one thing that popped, and now people are going to know how funny you are as an individual and as a stand-up. It all is awesome, dude. But it then it's awesome, also, dude. obviously, thank you guys you. have but the thank chops. Thank you. That means a lot coming thank from you guys. You. Yeah, you guys much. have the chops, but then also, the reason why I think you guys are blown up right now is because you're two solid people. Oh, you know what I'm saying? You. Like, you guys are actually good mm. people. Thank you, man. Yeah. That's yeah, why just, everybody fucks with you. Like, every, I'm telling you, dude. You name a New York comic, every single one mm. was like, you have to do that mm. show. Have to do that show. Fuck I just yeah. like having somebody I know next to me on the plane so I don't feel awkward. Yeah, yeah he's taking, tough. Take, he's, taking he's a, a tough oh, guy on the plane. Gotcha, gotcha. It's not easy. 28 yeah. A and a half, you know <laughs> yeah. what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, we, our producer, shout out to Toby, he unfortunately gets placed next to him. He's nice. the buffer. Nice. For nice. whatever, yeah. and I'm like, yeah. It's like a fucking, uh, he's, that's a real comics, road So dog. we're all like-minded, goofing around, it's, it's fun. It's like it's a, a Tom time. Selleck movie where he's <laughs> sitting in the seat, the other guy's like, yeah. Yeah. on the poster. <laughs> dude, you know I mean? turned, dude, I turned around the one day we were on a plane flying fucking somewhere, and I turned around and go to the bathroom. Selleck. He's in the aisle. Like, his head is in the <laughs> middle great. of the aisle, just hanging out. I, I had a, There was a learning curve involved in that. I always thought as a fat guy, you want the window. Never. But they fuck you in the window because they don't let that thing come up. Yeah. And yeah. I reach back. I, I dig that. around. I Even dig around I and try that. to 
Try to find like a like a dead man switch back there. Yeah. <laughs> but you always go aisle because then once we take off, you lift that up and <laughs> pop a cheek aisle. out there. Aisle all day all, long. All the Snack time, time it's tough. And sometimes those those flight attendants get real aggressive with that card. <laughs> yeah, the card. They know I'm there. Then you're fighting for the elbow space. If you're the aisle, fighting he for just that had that space. with some guy fighting for the elbow I've, space. All, the way out here, I fought with him for five, fucking five hours in my head. And I'm like, I'm a, yeah. I might fucking if he says something, I'm like, I, we're gonna get. This is just like that's just how angry it was. Yeah, it was like duct tape. Dude, it was like seat. trench war, yeah. warfare yeah, for the elbows, happen. for the knees. Yeah. Yeah. He's out of my know. zone. <laughs> and then at the end, I was like playing just like a stupid game, like on the screen, just like killing time. I was playing like fucking tic tac toe or something. He's like, hey, you want to borrow my fucking Nintendo Switch or whatever? I'm oh, like, oh, you nice. are a nice guy. I've oh, done just a lunatic. Let's well, talk yeah. about trash. Playing the games on the back of your seat on an airplane. That yeah. Toby super got he became yeah. a battleship, and we were using the uh, what to do with an emergency cards to block so we couldn't see. Do they have that in first class? They have that stuff up there? No, no, they give you the actual board game. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you get your own battleship. Actually, you all miss Pac Man. So. <laughs> that is a thing we have B7. leveled up. We're yeah. now flying first class. This was our last a little bit. Our last economy flight was out here and back, and then from here on out, all the tickets. You got for the it. But we really flight. can't afford it technically. Yeah, but I gotta buy like three years in advance. You know what I mean? To Tickets. Yeah, using miles. It's all you know. It's the it's the optics of it too. Yeah, but bet on yourself. You you only make more money, so it's good. Well, it's also like we're fortunate the Patreon does very well, so mm. it's like mm. your Patreon's you huge. know fucking it's good. like free money. It's like drug dealer money. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah, we don't like, use our miles. Poor people don't use their miles. But we, we save those. You save it for like <laughs> yeah. a, a, a once in a lifetime vacation. <laughs> yeah. I'm to going old, to the to Orlando. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm using the the miles to Orlando. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I know you're fucking garbage. Yeah, but I'm flying on a Thursday. Huh? That's too bad. <laughs> Uh, all right, Nick. Let's get to it. So, do you, if you guys know how the show works, the fans submit. They submit stuff. I honestly still don't know how the show works. <laughs> <laughs> Not a fan of the program. <laughs> uh, we actually asked our fans, or we had a number of fans who wanted to find out if they were garbage. Oh, so okay. we have some of those. Hilarious. Oh, look at this little dude. Hey, what's up, team? The Sting, the Wing, and the Are You Garbage team. I've got one for you. So, I was in jail in 2012. <laughs> this guy's classy right years. away. In that time, I learned how to make a lot of food. Some spread, some dishes. Well. Uh, sweet and sour chicken. Hooch. All this stuff. And uh, now, ten years later, I'm married with a kid. I still make those dishes at home. I still serve them to my son. Um, my favorite is uh, chili, chili pickle spread. It's uh, basically ramen noodle with chili and pickle, all wrapped up in a tortilla. Yeah, you're not in prison. Uh, like yeah. Shit, I'm so really good. Um, Sounds but, awful. Does that make me garbage? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Look at his son. The cell block like gourmet. Healthy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> Am I garbage? Oh, oh, that's dude. great. That's fantastic. Ah, he's so I mean, cute. That's an easy one, huh, fellas? <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know. <laughs> making jailhouse meals, oh, even though you've been out 10 years. Yeah, you're making it for awesome. your family. It that's so, wild. It honestly sounds, that sounds like it would be so good. It sounds disgusting. No, dude. You're, oh, yeah, it sounds all right. It, yeah. Oh. A chili ramen burrito. Hey. Come on. It, all hey. the things that I like. I'm gonna get a DUI after this. Chili, <laughs> ramen, and burrito, bro. You like, you like ramen? Not really. No, All right, ramen noodles. You like chili? Hey, can can I say something? Hopefully, it doesn't get my brother in trouble. Okay, well. When we were kids, we had you know we grew up poor. We had ramen noodles, yeah. and then I I <laughs> put extra flavoring in it. Yeah. And my brother goes, "You know that's Chinese sweat. They make that Chinese sweat." I never ate it again. Oh, Jesus Christ! My, my dad. That's is that racist? Fuck. I mean, well, he was what five, so fuck it. Yeah, you six, can be seven. racist when you're yeah, five. Yeah, because that's Chinese. Sweat. I was fucking. I was ahead of the, when I was out. nine. I'm I was out. I was ahead of the local ch the clan. And they sweat. <laughs> um, but the, uh, the chapter, they whatever it was, delicious. I don't remember. I had the purple outfit. But the um, <laughs> what was the fucking? Not the ring my, Yeah, <laughs> purple or red? The empirical as wizard. Nine year old. Yeah. yeah. Hey guys. Um, <laughs> what was the fucking thing? Uh, my dad. I have a story like that. My dad told me. I used to love those neutral grain bars. You remember those neutral? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Shout out yeah. to the neutral right, yeah. grain bars. Basically yeah. Snickers, but yeah. And I, yeah, yeah I know. Yeah, yeah. So, so I, I would eat them all the time. And then my, I said, hey, hey, dad, how come you never eat these neutral grain bars? And they say he literally just threw it out. He said, oh, they actually make your butt fat. And I never ate one again, <laughs> yeah. dude. It's just not true. I still don't eat them. Because like that's subconscious. Yeah, the, yeah. yeah. Oh, I've had ramen since I was six, so I, and I still think it's Chinese sweat. <laughs> <laughs> that Chinese sweat is good though, bro. It's, yeah, it's, it's fantastic. It's, salty. it's all so but it's great. Ramen is something too that you forget about, and then you're like, oh yeah, I could get ramen. And then you go get ramen and you're like, cents. why don't I ever think of this? Uh, yeah. well, well, A, because it's so unhealthy. You ever looked know, at the nutrition facts? It's not good. I have to be Calabasas on you guys, not but it is. So <laughs> ramen is so unhealthy. Yeah. Yeah. That's why it's good. Ramen, burrito, and what was it? Ch chili? chili. And pickles. pickles. Oh, and pickles. Even better. 
That's You're why disgusting. the pickles. Oh, I, I can leave the pickles. Hey, fellas, yeah, he, yeah, he's yeah, garbage. Yeah. yeah, that's garbage. <laughs> garbage behavior. It's yeah, garbage, garbage behavior. behavior for sure. It's but it be. sounds good. The only thing I would say with with with, uh, with this gentleman is um, if you if he maybe like elevated the ingredients because I would assume sure. that in uh, prison, go to a Trader Joe's instead of the commissary. Yeah, you know, yeah, what the I mean? farmers market is probably not the best in there. I would assume. <laughs> so as long as he's getting like good stuff and put it, I could see the combination, but. I mean, it would be I'm hilarious out. if there was a farmer's market in prison. <laughs> <laughs> How's the produce today? Yeah. Ooh, the tomatoes right? Shanking guys. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. You got to get out That's of that. That's a tough one. Yeah. That's yeah. So wait, he was in jail for how long? Did you? I think he said ten years. I think he said he was out ten. He's been out ten years. I forget. Yeah, ten years. But still, he's still hiding like shit in his ass. But you had to been in there. You had to been in there a long time to become like a culinary expert. You know what I mean? Like he's been in there enough. You're you jail. He's the not just kicking cut? around ideas. Yeah. It really depends how true to the script he's keeping these recipes. Like I said, if he if he's getting different ingredients and doing it a little bit better than what he has in there, but if he's putting like fucking shampoo in it, like you know, what I mean? <laughs> yeah. the secret ingredient's yeah, a little yeah, toothpaste. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. That's not good to be feeding your kid that. Yeah, right. yeah. If his date nights hooch that he's been making for three <laughs> yeah. weeks with his wife, mm. get some hooch over here, babe. All right, kids, nobody flush the toilet for a couple yeah. hours. <laughs> I got a fresh batch in there. <laughs> What's this lady want, Nick? What's this broad one? We're closed. <laughs> hey guys, I think it's like a ring cam. When I was 14, I would steal my brother's weed after he would go to work. He was 17. I would steal just little pinches at a time. Me and my friends would smoke it, get high, and be so scared when he would come home from work. Paranoid um, so from the weed. Garbage for stealing my brother's weed. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz, or. That's great. Do, 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 do. Nope, that's McDonald's. Okay, she did it so quick. That's good. Yeah. I like when they're yeah. quick and shit. Yeah. That yeah, was very well executed. Yeah, that's, I mean, who didn't? Yeah, who didn't steal weed? someone's weed? Who yeah. didn't pinch a bag of weed at some point? You got but, to. Yeah, Especially your older pinched. brother. I like how she smoked weed and then was so scared that her brother was going to find out. It's like, you were just from the weed. Yeah, that's the weed. Yeah. That's, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's the, the weed talking. That's, that's anxiety the anxiety from the weed. She's that's like, like uh, the guy who made the sandwich would be like, I, I don't know why I keep shitting myself. <laughs> <laughs> The yeah, chili burrito. I guess most people do it. I didn't steal weed. We weren't big weed guys growing up. My brother had a, a convertible Mustang, and the new Game Boy Color came out, and I stole his Mustang when I was 13 mm. and drove Jeez. it to Toys R Us. When you were how old? I was 13. And it was a toy Mustang. Yeah. Oh, uh, no, no, no. It's an actual Mustang. <laughs> you, you were 13. You think you stole his Power Wheels? <laughs> car? Well, because he was 13. I'm trying to merge here. I stole his car. It was, it was all like, you know, neighborhood driving. I mean, but I, I need Still? a Nintendo. <laughs> okay. I want a red Nintendo uh, Game Boy. Wow. Yeah, that's Grand Theft Auto. She stole some weed from her. <laughs> yeah, I mean, she's from a good time, brother. Bag. Yeah. <laughs> I'm garbage here. She's good. I like you guys know when you kill a guy, in, right? Yeah. <laughs> Ran over a few people. I know what she's oh, wow. talking about. Oh, this, this, is, this is Theo. Theo I thought that and, was Theo for It's Theo's brother. And Mark awesome. Wahlberg had a fucking. <laughs> He also talks really fast. It's a tight okay. mullet right nice. there. He's in a hot tub, or is that a standalone? Yo, garbage gals, cats crew. What do you think? Old tank, turn it into a pool. Oh, yeah. King, king, <laughs> garbage, recycling, sore or snore. Well. <laughs> Wear glasses, anything's classy. Remember that? Chin, say something. Love y'all. <laughs> 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 I got to go. Just that like didn't happen to one take. I no, can tell yeah. you. Yeah. No, yeah. He was out there for a while. Let's take 19s. <laughs> oh, That's this fantastic. lukewarm water sucks. We've seen that a bunch. People, because like we talk about above ground pools versus in ground pools mm -hmm. versus like a standalone hot tub and that a lot of that <laughs> shit. And a lot of people in the country have these like horse tanks or whatever that they then just turn into. Like above pools. ground pools for like eighty bucks. The only thing that makes yeah. that Complete classy. Trash. I kind of get it's kitschy. It'd be fun. I get it. If but you have like, kids, it's like a one-off thing. You I get sure. some fucking tiki torches around that though. Sure, and you shit. can make it work. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, a, if it uh, can be yeah. like pill. it can be fun and wacky. The yeah. back of a pickup is fun when people put tarps in there. And but fill you're it up. just basically fucking. It's like a chick with glasses and a hat on. You're just disguising how ugly it really is. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's like we we know what you really look like. You're not funky. Yeah. <laughs> Funky. It's not an infinity. You're not fucking funky. You're not funky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not funky. Stop with the shit. You know, girls. These are prescription. This is bullshit. Yeah, 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 yeah. The only thing that makes that classy if he's sitting in a if it's a big thing of ice, right? That's what that's like what, an ice right. like an ice yeah. bath. Yeah. Right. An athlete. I mean, it looks like he's got a nice piece of property. I see a palm tree yeah, in the yeah, back. Yeah, it looks yeah, like he's got, yeah, a, yeah. got a little bit Florida? of land. Is that Florida? What are you I talking about? You do that, right? You ice bath. Yeah, yeah, I do ice bath. You got that out there. My six year old does ice bath. Jesus. Yeah, he saw a thing on Tom Brady. He's obsessed with Tom Brady. It's very strange. Where do you do it in your bath? 
What's up? Where do you do the ice? No, pack? we have a. a he tub. stole the car. Yeah, right? yeah. <laughs> you have an ice tub. Yeah, we have. Oh, tub. you have one. Yeah, you have, have one. one. Yeah. Like cook, like running at all times. Not all times, but he wants to go in. We do. You it. make it freezing, or freezing. it's always freezing. No, we make it freezing. We dump in ice <clears> and we get the water circulating. You wouldn't expect. I would expect that he would have that back there. I would expect he does it. I, do, I wouldn't necessarily expect you to actually have one. Just like a trough. You know what yeah, I'm saying? I got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And then you have the I hot don't really tub. know what you know, it is, cold, to be honest. Hot, cold. Do you, have, yeah, you yeah. have a hot tub at the house? Yes. Yeah, sauna, yeah. too? I would assume you have a hot tub. No sauna, hot tub. Really? No sauna? Uh-uh. I'm shocked. That's no, my... Logan's a sauna guy. I'm not a sauna Neither guy. Hot tub connected huh. to the pool? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I can't that's remember. the way Is there a waterfall going down to the pool? There's a waterfall, yes. Okay. You guys got waterfall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a calabasas, you know? Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's actually an ordinance. You have to We're have trying, a waterfall. You know, you're you're keeping yeah. up with the Joneses. Try keeping up with the Kardashians. <laughs> it's exhausting. Do you have a pool? I have a pool. Yeah, I got a pool, and a hot tub is connected to it. Yeah, yeah. In the, place, in the place you're building, you're putting in a pool. I'm gonna put in a pool. Yeah, with a hot tub. Yeah, nice. Yeah, but you guys, like in New York, like I'm, I would never. Nobody has pools. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't, I, yeah the Vanderbilts. <laughs> yeah, they, they, yeah. They yeah it's one. like you guys. A pool have, in New York would cost you fourteen yeah, million dollars to have the <laughs> also, land for a pool. Yeah, where would, like, would you put it on? <laughs> unless there's one of Paltrow, you're not getting a pool, man. <laughs> yeah. I mean, most hotels don't even have pools. There's like four rooftop. Pools. So like what? Well, like in New York, what? be balling like the penthouse in some building yeah right? there's that yeah. shit there's that like like that billionaire like you know mm -hmm. all those international billionaires coming and buy like 50 million dollars yeah, i don't know if podcasts and, and stand-ups gonna get us there fellas no so, i don't think so no, no that's tough i don't know man but like chrissy d lives in uh staten, staten island, island. Beautiful. Yeah. he has a great home but that's Beautiful. staten island's like you know that's the bar you're, you're thinking it, like like where harry osborne lived in well, spider-man you, well to me staten island's like either you're a family man or you're in the mafia yeah there's no yeah, it's in very between. it is it's very like it's like <laughs> it's very like big nice houses or, there's a couple you know. of plumbers over there too yeah, yeah. a couple I mean, of HVAC guys yeah if you want but if you want to live in New York and have like a three bedroom like place mm -hmm. you, you, you gotta be Beyonce you gotta be, you gotta be Beyonce making 20 million dollars a year to own it yes to own it yeah, yeah. I mean to those houses like right. you know those houses like down in the village like a brownstone or whatever right. it's like two stories or whatever and you guys yeah. want to stay million there. Mil and, and, like but 10, you guys 11 want, million yeah, dollars but you guys yeah. want to stay there well we don't know now I don't know we were I told talking you, we got the we, we got the rundown from Timmy D we I from think who but Dylan, yeah, but Timmy, to do what though? Timmy's to, to, smart, but that's what. Yeah, he was like, smart. you gotta start, yeah. you know, Prop real estate. Me and Timmy talk about this yeah. all the time. Like, but we were talking about the this summer. I can't really. I mean, we, I've been in New York ten years. I'm really hating the the winners, and oh, now that I, I have can't. a couple oh, of bucks, I, can't. I think we might uh, relocate the whole. No, oh, yeah, right. We, but yeah, uh, we might relocate the whole operation down to Lake St. Pete or like outside Tampa. Wow. There just is for the winner. Nothing oh, more New York. Just, just for a couple months. There's nothing more New York than doing that. That's hilarious. Of course. I would always say I'm from and New Jersey. And it's so new money, too. And open up a hot dog cart. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and a long time. Yes. I always say I'm from New Jersey, but no, nothing is more Jersey than living in Florida. Like, oh, nothing yeah. is more New Jersey than living in Florida. It's it's like it's where everybody they just migrate. Everybody. Yeah. My yeah. parents are talking about, yeah, yeah, yeah. we might buy a place in Florida. Dude, I love there. Tampa, man. Yeah, Tampa's yeah, Tampa, great. St. Pete's great. Clubs, yeah. Yeah. The clubs there. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, we could fucking there's clubs a life, there. Bro, we can do a weekly, could do a weekly, weekly are fuck you fuck garbage? garbage? Headliners come in. They're the guests. The whole fucking thing. Let's do it. Back so out. Get these guys gators. going. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, get a pontoon boat or something for a mm. couple of months. <laughs> that's That's my level. That's what I think success <laughs> yeah, is, yeah, by yeah. the way. Get caught up with the Colombians. Start running. Bam, bam. Couple of cigarette boats. Yeah. Woo! Last break, Cats fans. Hopefully you're enjoying this episode with the Are You Garbage Boys, so Foley you, and Kevin. UFC 275 is here. And yes. DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of the UFC, has a heavyweight offer for this weekend's fight with a special parlay for all of our listeners. Go ahead. Listeners and viewers, listen, they're they're riding with your boy here, your thick friend. They said pick three fighters. We're going to boost the odds. Who would you pick? Dude, I picked Gary in the main event against Glover Texera. He needs to get it done in the first two rounds. If it goes past two, it's going to get a little dicey. Okay. I think Glover's going to grapple him, price him in the fourth or fifth, so we need it done in the first two rounds for Ben on Yeri. Then you got Shevchenko. She wins. She uh, defends the most times ever for a female fighter, the most title defenses ever. She beats Ronda Rousey if she wins that fight. Then you got Weile. Weile, Young Junchek is the fight. It's the co-main event. That fight is fantastic. So you go to DraftKings Sportsbook, uh, head to the app now under the UFC page to check out Brendan's picks and bet on it and ride along with him. Right now, all customers can place a same game parlay for Saturday's fight, and if it hits... 
you'll double your winnings. Yes. Download the DraftKings Sports app right now. Use promo code KATS. New customers can throw down five dollars on UFC 275 and get 150 buckaroos and free bets instantly. That's code KATS this Saturday at DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of the UFC. Minimum age eligibility restrictions apply. See show notes for details. How do you? Uh, how I'm do in. you guys? How'd you blow up? <laughs> I'm in. What happened? Uh, I want um, in on this. Looking back. Back. Mine was late night eating. If you, if you <laughs> and the carbohydrates. <laughs> that, yes, that is what I was asking. Carbs no. are not your friend. The pandemic screwed me. It I'll was bees for him, actually. I was skinny before the pandemic. No, no, no. But how did, the, how did you guys get... How did it happen? I think, like, looking back at how it happened, I think we had been podcasting for, like, 10 years together for like a hundred listeners that nobody gave no like, shit. Like, no shit. Are you garbage for 10 no, years? No, it was already garbage. We that. had a thing called the Center City Comedy Podcast and we had a thing called Hard Feelings that we now just do. That's a whole Get other show on our Patreon. Here. So we've been doing it together for 10 years and we're like, we're real, you know, you know, we're very good together. Just working comics in the city. Doing trying this, to come up. Hosting, running yeah. around. And then we were tight with all these big comics. Right, the right, Schultzes, right. the Gillises, because yeah. we were working comics in the yeah. city, but we just hadn't popped. Mm. Uh, and then the pandemic hit and mm. we had launched this we had launched Are You Garbage two weeks. I think we were two episodes in and then the pandemic hit. I was I remember talking, I was talking to my wife. I'm like, I can't fuck. Like, this one can't fail as yeah, well. Like yeah. I we just so she's we doubled like, no down. Shit. Yeah, yeah, she's like, of course something's <laughs> she also moved from Germany she to was be with me. So I'm like, I have to fucking <laughs> oh, your doubled wife's, your down wife's German. German. Yeah. Doubled Ooh. down in what way? What? We started doing two episodes a week. Wow. Because I'm like, well, like we can start all these get friends that we were with, or the, all these sitting people around we were friends at home with, on Zoom. Sitting around and I'm like, Hey, you want to do the podcast? I'm like, fucking, of course. I love you guys. No, it would have taken to five years to get them all in studio. Yes. But like wow. in a row, I think we went like Norman, Soder, Schultz, Gillis, and like that really started. Wow. Plus, I think it's a unique, like you said, it's a unique. Yeah, it's unique. Yeah. So people were like, oh, this is fucking cool. It's I had different. the best time because, again, most podcasts is just, you know, shooting the shit. This mm -hmm. is a little different because we have fans of sure, But of in general, like Find Kid or whatever it is, just shooting the shit nonstop. Mm -hmm. So it's like when you get to do something where there's like kind of a, um, not, not a produce element, but there's like some a, sort of theme a, or like yeah, underlying yeah, theme. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, yeah, it's not, uh, yeah. And another thing wild. we realized too, especially when we were doing them via Zoom, the questions we asked, they're like stupid. It's like, you know, what kind of fucking vacations did you go on? What kind of car did your mom drive? Like all that kind of, like, did you drink milk with dinner? And we were getting these stories that, comics never told on stage or mm. on podcast before so you know you're going to a podcast you're like oh i'm going to try to work in the fucking yeah, yeah, yeah. getting called with my yeah. pants down the yeah. hand job yeah. story all that shit <laughs> no one's asking if your grandmother's patio had astro turf yeah, right. yeah. And we yeah. were getting you would see comics be like oh, i haven't thought about this in 15 uh, years 100 and now they're telling it and That's so it's funny. like we were getting different stories that yeah no brings one up like original organic like thoughts like when i like, those questions you ask like fuck i haven't talked about that in <laughs> yeah 10 years which was not yeah. by design like Got we realized it afterwards deep, huh? <laughs> yeah my therapist knows but happy now you guys know happy the accident, fruit loops yeah. in a bag uh, yeah, powdered what's milk up, daddy yikes <laughs> let's do it nick uh, <clears throat> so this is one of ours debate. This guy's like, in the fucking shower Jesus. doing this? And that shower is underground, by oh, the way. Oh, man. That window. <laughs> look, bro. That guy is subterranean <laughs> at the moment. <laughs> that has one of those storm things around <laughs> yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. Holy oh, shit. What's up, fellas? Hope everything's good. I hope My you're good. Yeah, is this an ISIS video? Yeah. Yeah. King of Stinger for you guys. I just got out of the shower and I was wondering... <laughs> You go with that bar soap <laughs> or that bullshit body wash. Oh, come on. That bar soap lets you get in and out, rub that thing all over, <laughs> set it down, rinse it off, and you're done. Does this guy's you face move? No <laughs> yeah, this guy's all perks for <laughs> sure. No Anyways, if he starts drowning a puppy, think. I will not be surprised. Bar soap all the way. Anyways, gang, gang, buzz, buzz. Look forward to hearing from you guys. Um, hopefully he's all right. Let's only check on that guy. Yeah, was he in a bunker in Ukraine? What that's is this wild. Thing? He's clean. Look at the air vent. Look how small, bro. Yeah. <laughs> he's like that's like that's like airplane style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, never body wash. Never. Bar. Really? Oh, yeah, wow. bar. Bar. Alone. Yeah, bar. What? I'm still bar. It's I'll do Irish Spring or Dove. Stuff. But the bar, yeah. What's I mean, your bar? Yeah, I guess it's got to so. be goat milk something. Nah, I don't. Yeah, do that what is shit. your bar? It has like the the the, the charcoal. No, no, in it I hate that shit. Actually, to it's fully annoying. your skin and shit. I just fucking have regular. Ooh, that's soap. like lava soap. Remember that, lava soap? You know what? That shit would get it off. Yeah, because Kristen get is your like tattoos off. She's like, uh, you should get into like a routine where you have all the. And I'm like, dude, I I, I can't with my with my <laughs> OCD. And then also like, it, part of me is like, it's a, kind of a scam. Like you know, there's. Uh, 
I can't believe you don't. I, I thought you would be all over this. I'm not. I'm Night not. People, eye cream. Yeah, people I'm think. Yeah, you, you look like a guy that takes baths. But let me tell you something though. People think <laughs> I love. I draw a nice yeah, bath. Like I don't nice love bath. Bath. I do a shower. I in and still out. do a nice bath. We're too big for baths. We are too big yeah, for baths. Yeah. But hold on. Us. I don't know why you had to bring that up. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, you're both fat of too, right? It's both of us. It's both of us. You know what? We do fit in though. Those what are they called? Tiger foot. Lions clubs, what are they called? Lions e foot Eagles tubs. feet tubs, oh. like the old ones. Oh, oh, like the oh, one you oh, see oh. like the for ring. like kings and for the like Queen Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, I could yeah, slide yeah. into one of those. Yeah, I guess I could. Yeah. <laughs> Traditional bathtub. Yeah, I'm out. No, 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 I'm out. I'm not as LA as people think I am. That's the truth. Well, like, dude, do I'm you have not. moisture on right now? Moisture on zero. On? Never have I ever done it. What's ever. in your hair? Dry as a bone. Uh, just product. I, I just put product in, but then I wash it like every three what, days. What do you use? Like a pomade? What are we talking about here? I guess it would be pomade. I don't even really know. And you just, you just. Yep. How Man, much I'm was that nice. haircut? Ooh. 70 bucks. What do you tip? I'm surprised that's low. Oh, I give her 100. You give Even 100 out 100 the door. 100 total or 100 on top? 100 total. Yeah. Nice. That's... Did she come to the house and do it or you no, get it done in the place? There. That's a you good do? deal. I know why I go there because there's a coffee shop next to it. I get the coffee, you know, me. Anytime a place is, I make it me sure too. it's near a coffee me place. Too. Yeah. I would have guessed the go. cut was like 200 and they were doing it at no. the house. Me too. She's a sweetheart. I love her. And I assume you'd see Gavin Newsom there when you're leaving. No, yeah, he has, he, but he has a nice hair. hair. He has a nice hair. 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 What do you pay for a cut? You probably you probably get it like weekly or something. Yeah, this is the dude that you look like, like you get it weekly. No, oh, I did when 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 I when I would do like fades, I'd go every week, especially yeah. if I'm going on the uh, road. But uh. I always wear a hat. Yeah. So it's like I'll, I'll get the sides. But that's about it. Mm. You know. But a Mexican cuts my hair for twenty dollars. <laughs> right. 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 Yeah, and he makes yeah, me, and he always makes I, whatever I tell him. He's like, yeah, no problem. And he always makes me look like his son. I'm like, all right, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't. Uh, I get my hair cut once every two, three months. Honestly, yeah, mm. yeah. We get the long. I know, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 What do we? Uh, you same same shit. What is Chris? Like once haircut. every how long? How? You haven't had a cut in a minute. I've been growing this for a while. Mm. I, but, I just started doing like you got to get a shape. Though. Nice haircuts, like mm -hmm. going to like a mm -hmm. salon. I go to the girl my girlfriend goes to now. Nice. I used to just go to the dudes next door, 15 bucks. Yeah, me, that's whatever. where I'm at right now. You never yeah. know what you're going to get. It's a wild card. Yeah. Sometimes but I don't like watch fucking it Wesley ever. Snipes. You never watch it? No. But I'm disgusting. He's attractive. No, I know. I thought you would have like this whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. It's, there's no way it's Irish Spring or something. No, like it's that. Dove. I think I use Dove. Dove's what? nice. Is it's it good. Is it nice? Dove's Not Dove's good. Him, Dove, Dove, Dove's the Ford of fucking. Yeah, so it's, uh, yeah. it's, it's yeah. been around forever. Hey, yeah, Fords it, are all right, man. I thought you cool. would have some. I, you know, yeah. I literally one of her friends makes it or something yeah, yeah, like yeah. that. Yeah. I literally just use whatever soap is there. At, not I, scented. I don't. I don't do. Oh, scented. I like a nice scent, dude. I like the three in one body. You know, shampoo, conditioner, body wash. I feel like I'm not. I don't trust that shit. Yeah, dude. The three in one. You're trying Daddy? to do too much. Fall back. All it's right? all the same shit. <laughs> Fall back. <laughs> Fall back. I don't fucking do the dishes much, in there dude. too. Yeah. Whatever you want, man. That's terrible. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. What's up, Chris, Brandon, and Theo, it's and Rick, everyone Rick, in the Rick whole production crew? Uh, I'm gonna keep this one short. Oh, it's I logic. A That's what I, was, I couldn't think of his name. Uh, would you rather live forever? Or die right now. Jesus! What the fuck? <laughs> Whoa, that's pretty deep. You can just live for the rest that of time. That's so terrible. Or you dude, die this dude, this guy needs a thing. <laughs> is he on his way for school shooting? Yeah, somebody, <laughs> somebody get a ping on this kid. Will you? Die <laughs> right, right now. <laughs> Someone alert the government. <laughs> Because I got news for you. That's not an option at all. <laughs> you would have to big live forever. Die right now or live forever. I don't know. Forever. That's probably hell, though. Green Watch Mile, it, Tom right? Hanks. He oh. touched the guy. He's he's like a okay. eight hundred years old or something. Yeah. He was doing okay though. That nursing home was pretty nice. But, <laughs> but I don't know who was paying <laughs> like, for that. Like what about? Dude, imagine being alive in three thousand years. That's gonna fucking. <laughs> I would one hundred. Imagine you watching all, all your it, friends dude. and family die. Yeah, you watch everybody die forever. My That's an answer is gonna be live forever. Always. What I want. <laughs> I want to watch. Forever? I want to watch everyone die. Everyone. <laughs> Friends and not friends, and then I want to make better. You know how somebody get this guy a cup of decaf. You know how Jesus yeah. dope, you know how yeah. dope your friends would be when you're like a hundred, two hundred, four thousand years old. Dude, dude, imagine the experience you're dropping. Exactly. Out of these fucking yeah, but days. nobody else is you, four thousand. You're trying to hang out with hundred year olds. It doesn't matter. Like, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. Here. Dude, Here, think about your thing. stand up. <laughs> three thousand years in, like four thousand year old. Three thousand years in, you're three thousand years old. Two thousand years from now, you guys don't remember. Huh? It would be, you guys don't remember this, but yeah, let me. <laughs> it was this guy George Clooney. Yeah. Go with me on this. No, everybody says that. Well, but and all your friends and your loved ones would all be gone, dude. Yeah, that would suck. But you're gonna make fucking new friends. You're gonna have a new family, and you will be a fucking gazillionaire. Yeah. yeah. 
and a, and a, and a, and like and a you, wizard. You'll be a wizard. I, I was yeah, just going to say, actually, I was just going to say wizard. I think you'd be able to figure stuff out. Like right when you meet people, you'd be like, I know that I met this kind of guy sure, 150,000 years yeah, ago. Yeah, yeah. You'd be a, you'd be <laughs> yeah. a god. No, you'll be Elon Musk. That's yeah, what but, you'd be. But, but imagine with, how Elon but Musk But not on the be. spectrum. But it could be real, like knowledge, knowledge sure. and shit. Imagine if you were Elon Musk, though, for, and Elon Musk was 4,000. I mean, are you kidding me? In 4,000 years, if Elon Musk was still alive, he would be Jesus Christ. Sure. He would be, I mean, That's dude, a lot of responsibility. You want that? Yeah. Off me right now. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. And I can end all of my anxiety now. Imagine having anxiety for the next 4,000 years. Okay. Dude, Put but, a gun but in but it. Imagine also, this. Imagine, imagine this. dying right now. Oh, no, no. Yeah, oh, so lights you, out, you baby. Kids, you don't have kids? No. Yeah, that's the yeah, thing. You can't die. Can't yeah, my kids die when you be like, ah, oh, fuck, we got to call the ambulance for this fat fuck. Get <laughs> yeah. him out of here. There's a chance he might die right now anyway, <laughs> yeah. or at least during the taping of this. Yeah, out of the four of us, <laughs> me and him are going. I, mean, <laughs> I don't know what the over I'm also is. not very healthy. So. I definitely wouldn't want to die right now. Fuck that. No, you yeah, imagine you you're nuts? just starting to pop and you pass Whoa. away. That's kind of romantic a little bit to me. The 27 Club? It We're is. past that, but... I know, like, but just you like... Be, you like the Kurt that'd make Cobain a hell of, of... That'd make one pretty good article. I don't like that you know stuff. I, mean? I don't like... You know, I when I was a kid, I, my parents would listen to like the oldies, and I would hear the stories of like Harry Chapin or like Jim yeah. Carocci or like Otis Redding dying yeah. before yeah. Yeah. Docks of the Bay came out or whatever it yeah. was. That shit used to bug me out. That's, you're getting ripped off. Fuck that. I'm going wizard. Yeah. It's like Heath Ledger before Dark Knight came out. He won an Oscar. Heath Ledger was still getting BJ's all day long, but yeah, dude, that's my thing. Think, dude, four thousand years old, dude. The stories you'd have with sluts. Are you kidding me? Yeah, yeah. like how many girls have you hooked up with? 4, 000, Excuse me. <laughs> do you keep, forty thousand? But also, do you keep looking older and older and older you would and older? Have to. No, you're Benjamin Button. You look exactly the same. No, nah, or do you stop at like you know fifty? That no, they freeze cool. you right now. You live oh, forever, that's right? Cool. Oh, I didn't if you stop at fifty. I mean, that's a no-brainer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah you got to right. yeah. you got to take that. It's What's the no plot brainer? from Interview with the Vampire, right? It's yeah, the same shit. Yeah. Good you're, movie. You're basically a vampire. Yeah. yeah. Well, you don't drink blood. Not Man, that was now. a deep-ass question. Yeah, it was. Yeah. That really it rattled dark. me. You start a whole new podcast. <laughs> I'm going to be thinking about that on the plane. That grocery store sure. bagger really got me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it was all right. <laughs> Put the bread on the bottom. I yeah, can even change the cucumbers. Great question. This doesn't really fit a category, but just a pretty good question. Hi guys, my name is Brooke and I'm from New Mexico. I have a question for you. Hottest girl in New Mexico. Do you have any naughty teachers in school? Or maybe not naughty, but maybe they were into things you didn't think that teachers would be into. <clears throat> Asking because I'm a teacher and I recently ditched a day of school to see Theo in Albuquerque. Yeah, it was worth going to sketchy Albuquerque to see Theo live. But my students wanted to know why I was gone for a day. I told them that I had an appointment out of town. They bought it. But it got me they wondering how many of my teachers were playing hooky to do stuff like that <clears throat> or weirder things. Ooh. So did you have any naughty or weird teachers growing up? I'm a huge fan of all of yours, everything you do individually, and this podcast. I love you all. Brendan, Eric, you're hilarious. Chris, four years ago, I peed my pants watching one of your Netflix specials. Not kidding. Peed my pants on my couch. Felt like I needed to share that with you. Two years ago, I discovered Theo, and I've been hopelessly in love ever since. Aww. Anyway, thank you guys for doing what you what do. What a sweetheart. Did yeah. you have any naughty I, mean, I wish she was my fucking teacher. My teachers look like fucking warlocks. Yeah, I got to say, I don't know, it's like a scumbag, but my brain did not go to playing hooky when she was throwing naughty around 16 <laughs> times. No. Yeah. I'm also not missing class if she's my teacher. <laughs> no shit. My yeah. teacher, Mrs. Decker, was fucking 6'4". Oh, yeah, all mine were warlocks. <laughs> yeah, we they were all warlocks trolls. or dudes. Yeah. We had a substitute that was in Playboy, 7th and 8th grade. <gasps> She'd roll in every once what? in a while. Uh, really? It'd be like, it'd be like Moses. How's that? <laughs> how's that legal? No, no internet. How's a Playboy yeah, model? Exactly. No internet. No she internet. Did in her, she did it in her twenties. Well, she was also an actress. She was in, I think, uh, a movie with John Travolta called Blowout. Not one of his biggest box. And, and that's probably time. it. If she's doing substitute teaching. Yeah, that was yeah, probably, yeah, the, that was that probably, probably the height yeah, of it. Yeah. 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 Regional theater, or whatever. And then she got into teaching. But dude, man, I had oh a teacher man. named Mrs. Roach. And she had cancer. Sounds hot. Yeah, dude. She had what? <laughs> bro, bro, she looked like Clint Eastwood. But dude, she fucking, she had cancer. And she, it's poor lady. She oh. had cancer in her nose. So uh. they, her nose is gone. Uh. So she looked like the the evil guy from Stranger Things with the, with the fucking, the skeleton yeah. Stranger Things 4. Mm -hmm. She's so ahead, ahead of her time. Dude, it was juice, but it was like wet and juicy. But her oh. nose is gone. I thought you were going to say she was hot. Yeah. No, I fucking, no, she had I never had a hot it was teacher. such a turn And she on. would teach like it was all good. 
Like yeah, your nose not, was it yeah. missing? Damn. Does anyone know the question? I knows. No. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's a tough. But then there I remember is. I was in the class. <laughs> I was in the class next door. Brendan, do your homework. That's how she. That, that's how she looked. <laughs> Brendan, stop talking back there. That's Mrs. Roach. Oh, poor and then lady. She, she, you know, she was older. And she fell. She tripped over like the projection uh, projector. Oh, this was a cord. fucking disaster. She fell, yeah. and then we just see her being carted out. I've ever heard. See her being carted out. Never saw her again. Keep it light, will you? you, can, <laughs> you can we got say, Disney coming in in a half so an hour. So the question is, do you guys think she's garbage? <laughs> <laughs> Missing a nose. Does garbage? Does she have a nose? <laughs> trash. You got cancer? That's trash. <laughs> so, all right. It was like wet in her face? Yeah, it was like Probably it was moist. Juicy. Yeah, moist. We had a teacher who had a, he, he was post-stroke. Mr. Talon, one side just hung over. Talon and Roach? What the fuck <laughs> is this? These are some wild ass names. Sounds like real sleazy lawyers, <laughs> yeah. Talon, Talon Roach. And Roach. We'll make her pay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, all right. No, have I? I don't think I've ever I had a hot teacher in, she was a science teacher. But I never, everyone always was like, she's so hot. I never thought, I was like, yeah, she's all right. But I never really had a fucking. Never had a hot teacher. Well, it's like no. when you see the news where it's like teacher has threesome with sure. seniors in high school and she's just a fucking dime piece. You're like, mm. what fucking yeah. the only what thing high that, school is this? These poor kids. The only yeah. thing that goes through my mind is how the fuck did anybody ever find out about that? Oh, when it's e when it's a hot girl and, mm. and, and guys. Well, that's easy, right? Because the parents are like, why is the kid always on his phone and fucking going into yeah. the Me and my friends would have, we would have took that to the grave. Mm. I don't that think been so. Like the Kennedy oh, I would have. I think it gets out. <laughs> you you tell will, you want to? Yeah, you would tell people. <laughs> I guess that's true. You're I would have gone with all my buddies. Sixteen, that comes out. Uh, uh, yeah, dude, yeah, you're at a house party. Mm -hmm. What have you been up to, dude? Mrs. Fields has been <laughs> sucking my <laughs> dick. <laughs> <laughs> what have you been up to, yeah. I've Barry? Been I've been Mrs. Roach. <laughs> I've been fucking Mrs. Roach's nose hole. <laughs> She won't stop calling me. <laughs> I've been busting Mrs. Roach's nose. Lady, you're married. Knock it off, will you? It was fun while it lasted. Put your face back on and get out of here, will you? Oh, yeah, fuck. <laughs> It's terrible. Jesus it's Christ. terrible. It's terrible. She's not alive, so that's all right. All yeah. right, what else you got, Nick? She's got people that knew her. Hey, guys. <coughs> my name is Mamie. I'm from New Mexico. All New um, Mexico. Sorry if you can hear birds. I'm sitting outside. Slight um, flex. But I have a debate club for you guys today. So, if you could choose any decade to be a teenager throughout, oh. what decade would you choose Think about why? this all the time. Great um, question. Do? The all the time. Yeah, it's wild to think about um, that all the time. The sixties, baby. Great question. The fashion, but why a teenager? Out? She said, "If you could be a teenager, because you like growing no up, no responsibility, uh, I guess. Oh, okay, you like know. the fun time. Okay. Yeah, you get like loose. You just, you yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Daddy. The right answer, because we live now, would be now. Because if we knew what we knew now." You go back to the fucking sixties. You'd be like, "What? Where's the fucking cable?" Right. You know, that's, turn the air on. Will very you? true. Yes. But if you didn't know any better, if ignorance was bliss, yeah. I the seventies seemed pretty cool. A lot of drugs in the seventies, but they were snatching uh, kids left and right. In yeah, the and the serial killers during the seventies. Serial killers, killers. Oh, yeah, not worse than now though. Not worse than N now. Dude. Name one serial killer functioning but right it seems now. yeah bro there's a documentary being made about him in 10 years we don't know him now they're getting That's away with kinda it That's kind of true no, you we don't know, know. we don't know do you know how the news would run with it if there was another they night stalker yet. yeah no i don't know i don't know I'm, but also dna and all that stuff all that shit that we had now makes it much harder for them to and there's cameras yeah. everywhere like yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it was scarier back then way scarier dude, get away on, with it throw dude. On, you want a scary movie Fucking Serial smuggling a throw wise. on Zodiac. Yeah. Yikes. Uh, yeah, yeah, he's still yeah. on the loose, Daddy. Well, he's dead probably, but. Yeah, I'm sure he's dead. Well, we'll see. I don't think he's out <laughs> there working still. Unless, unless, he, unless he's living until he's 4,000. That's true. Um, yeah, yeah, you're right, though. It was scarier in that respect back then, probably. Yeah. But, it was also more dangerous back then. Way more dangerous. Even though yeah, we have I, all these mass shooting stuff. You I guess look, I wouldn't know. Statistically, People are way more kids. dangerous. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah kids yeah. getting taken left and right. Oh, Vans yeah. were okay back then. Yeah, they yeah, were Nobody knew fucking. Bosses people, all people like hitchhiked. back then, too. They would be like, yeah, yeah. let me get in your car. Imagine straighter. hitchhiking. Yeah, right no, now. yeah. People were dumb as fuck back then, huh? Dumb as fuck. Dude, Just you know what's crazy? If shit. you go down to Pang or go down PCH, you'll see hitchhikers. I'm like, dude. You're nuts Are to you try out of your fucking now. mind? Have you never seen a movie? That's yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. A hitchhiker? Also, where am I going to drive you, bitch? What are we talking about? Where I'm going to Santa Barbara. I'll drop you off there, and that's as far as I go, you know? Imagine saying that. I'll drop you off where yeah. I'm going, and then you're on your own. Like, what the fuck? That's yeah, how Rambo weird, started. Bro. You saw how that ended, too. What'd, What'd you that? say? So that's Theo how Rambo started. started, and you saw how that <laughs> ended. Oh, yeah. Theo picks up hitchhikers and films them. Goes Instagram Live. <laughs> Jesus. He does for the content. Really? In Hawaii. 
I don't know. That's, that's a, probably a little different, I would assume. It's a little yeah, more was cultural. it somebody that looked like Theo and they were just like, hey, what's up? Basically, gang, gang. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. good vibes. Jump yeah, in, yeah. brother. Yeah. Let's roll. Yeah. 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 He's not going down Skid Row picking up right. hitchhikers. <laughs> you know, that's a different animal. Hop in. You want something Dude, to eat? Dude, some of those streets in LA are dicey. Yikes. I got up early this morning because I was jet lagged. I went to the 7 Eleven. It was staying? a block away. I almost turned around twice. Where are you staying? Well, where you are is there like is Hollywood. That, at, yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's that. Especially North Hollywood. I saw a guy with a new tent this morning outside, like a brand new ten. Oh, yep. for him. He's fucking he's got, right you know what he's Crush got? He just his fucking, Patreon must be just doing got all right. Just got a podcast, yeah. <laughs> or an OnlyFans. <laughs> Who's only doing fan his ad sales? Yeah. That's yeah. what I want to know. Selling some merch, huh, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> like to see it. Man, it's more females than we've ever had. Thanks to the They heard we voice. were on the show, Garbage. you know, it's yeah. no big deal. <laughs> Hello, King and the Sting and the Wing and everybody in between. Mm. Um, I am mm. staying up way past my bedtime. Uh, and Sounds I am addressing... Like envelopes to all of my um, fellow graduates of class of 2002 because we have our 20th class reunion this summer oh, wow. um, and I mistakenly ran for class president my senior year. Uh, so my question nerd is, alert. Yo, you don't have to do that. class reunions, are you going? Bro. Are you not going? Is this a waste Look. of my time? Nobody's going to show up. Let me know. You're the, thought, you're, the cla- you're the class president. Yeah. And in 20 years, you're like, it's my responsibility. Yeah. <laughs> Leave office. That's hey. a good person. Hey, <laughs> resign. Shame. After yeah. 40 years, though, you know, yeah. you're out. Just change. That's don't, insane. You don't have to do that. No, no one's going to be like, Linda never fucking yeah. sent me a can you, be, can you believe Linda didn't get the shit together, organized? <laughs> That's <laughs> fucking nuts. Um, also, Are you, have, do you guys go to your reunions? I, never, I haven't. I didn't go to my five, my 10, or my, never. I guess, 15. Never. No. They, they they I've, been a, I've been a loser through all of them, though. Yeah. The maybe maybe, maybe the next one I might bit. catch. Um, f- five, ten, didn't do those. So my twenty year came up, uh, however long ago it was, f- three, four years ago, and um, I, I didn't want to go, but I was mostly friends with kids, the grade above me. Slight flex, right? But yeah, but I was though, <laughs> and they the, and they Is all Brewer told and me. Mahoney here. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Let's they go to Merce's place. Right? So <laughs> they all hey fellas, get the old Trans Am out. Huh? He show up, hand out a couple of nuggies, and leave. <laughs> <laughs> Push a few kids in lockers. Later, losers. <laughs> so they all told me that it it was amazing. Theirs was amazing because I didn't go to theirs. Right? Duped. They're like, you got to go. It was. We all didn't want to go too. You're making a mistake. You gotta go. Hold so on. I, you went to your five. No, I didn't go to any of them. Twenty years. Like, fuck, I gotta go to them. I still keep in touch with two of them, but okay, I don't care. Yeah. You know? Where'd you grow up? La Cunada, like near. Uh, okay. The Rose Bowl, right? So, okay. <clears throat> so I just didn't go because I don't know. I was probably on the road or some shit. But um, they were like, "You gotta go," and so I was like, "All right, I'll go if you say something." I went, and it was. I was like, I should not have come. Yeah. Like it was just kind of not fun. I, I enjoyed seeing some of the people, but I also could text them and would hang out with them and see them individually anyway. I'm big on, like, if I wanted to see... There's probably, like, four people yeah, the, exactly. outside of my circle that would be like, oh, shit, how you doing? Good to see yeah, you. There's a but sadness like, to it, too. I don't want to oh, find well, out. Dude, of course. There's a real sadness. Yeah. Like, there's this one kid who was a dime piece. I mean, he was the king of the school. Yeah, yeah they're not that. They peaked then. <laughs> yeah. That was the best he's got. And then I was... Uh, last time I was in Denver, I went to the grocery store to pick up... I don't know, whiskey or fucking Pepsi. It was whiskey. Yeah, probably. And I'm or nicotine. But I was walking around the fucking uh, aisles of King Supers mm-hmm. and I see this guy in a full fucking sweatsuit. And no 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 nose. No 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 the full sweatsuit. It was Johnny Roach. <laughs> Dude, go, yeah, a, you know yeah, my mom. Are you the one that fucked my mom's <laughs> nose? <laughs> it runs in the family. Try that with me, tough guy. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Mrs. Roach, we're sorry. But, dude, I see this guy in a matching sweat outfit, which he probably shouldn't do, and his gut's out to here, mm. and, I'm, and his hair used to have long, going yeah. long. His hair's, like, fucking yeah, terrible. Yeah, of course it is. Mm-hmm. And, then I, and then finally I can see he's following me. I turn around, hey, can I help you with something, man? I thought it was, like, a fan or something. He goes, bro, come on. Wow. I'm not going to say his real name, but yeah. Yeah. Brian me, Bowser, Brian, blah, Biff. blah, Biff. and Biff. I was all, oh, what's up, dude? Yeah. Holy shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Been some tough years, Daddy. You see their face inside their face. You're like, oh yeah. I it's see like it. da- the, when you graduate high school, and if you stay a lot of times in your town, mm. there's a certain section of those people who age like dogs. Right. It's like yeah. if you're posted up at the fucking <laughs> pub every three right. days, right. you're just like and they all become like 
There's like <laughs> you know a group of people that stay from each year, and then they all just become oh, wow. yeah, become this weird at the like bar. yeah. So so there's like a forty year old hanging out with a twenty one year old. It's just. And the 40 year old's wearing his Letterman jacket. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> what what are, are you doing? doing? People have kids. I mean, that fucking sucks the life out of people. Sure. You yeah. know? I don't it's know. It's also the best thing. But also, would, would I that, guess it could, yeah. It could, yeah. Like, it, I'm, I'm talking getting up, going to work. Yeah, if you're you know, like a fucking the roofer routine or something. Or having money and having Fair a kid. Fair point, is a lot fellas. Easier, yeah. yeah. Fair point. Yeah. I mean, we tell dick jokes, you know, so right, it's right, right. not right. the most but, grueling right, thing. Right, but it's right. also weird, like, if you go back to your high school reunion, it's like, you have you can't relate to them. Like, what have you been doing? They're working nine to five, and you're talking about stand-up, your, your patron that makes more money in a month than they right, make in a year. Right, you know what right. I'm mean? saying? It's like, I don't know, man. Yeah, yeah. but that's great. I would, like I said, I would I, I would have been a loser at every one. Like, oh, yeah, I'm still waiting tables, dude. He would have been, been the guy like, Shab, it's me, Foley. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. Remember the game against <laughs> Valley? <laughs> 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 Remember we put those N80s yeah, in the toilets? Yeah, yeah. Like, no. Anyway, can you no. pay my rent this month? <laughs> anyway, man, I hate to do this, I had dude. A, I bumped dude. into a dude, like, right after I he's just getting, moved to New York. He's chili and pickles and bread. <laughs> <laughs> dude, it up remember you fucked Mrs. Roach's <laughs> nose? <laughs> Sorry, Look what I, I made for the yeah, party. That was, that was a timely one. Uh, <laughs> I had a dude good. who was, like, in... Uh, oh, man, that was great, too. You just whoa, missed whoa, three fifths. That was a good one. Wow, I was getting a I did I did The Iceman's here. <laughs> I feel like I'm in high school again. Okay, go ahead. No, he kid. did hang out with the older kids. No idea. <laughs> <laughs> it's everybody in here can suck my fucking dick. All right? Well, dude, I love that. I, I, dude, I didn't want to go back into it just then, but I'm like, all right, buddy, you were broadcasting here. Even though uh, comedy, I'm like, there's no I'm way sorry. that's going to work. That's like getting heckled. They're like, finish the joke. And Professional. Like, suck it's dick. over, dude. Yeah, dude, I didn't want to do it the second time. You ruined the punchline. Yeah. Bro, I can't. I feel like I'm there daily. <laughs> it just wherever. It was doing a podcast just with family, with friends. You're like, uh -huh. all right, I'm, I'm not saying it. <laughs> Fuck yeah, that's he it. just went emergency. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's hysterical, bro. Uh, so sorry, there I am in New York. <laughs> <laughs> so I thought I was dead, right? That's a veteran, man. He just powered that's through the great. story. <laughs> We're all. It's my closer. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I check bots, a son of a bitch. Should we let him go? Or should we no. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, over. you should let me tell the story, then played her. That, that would have been it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm Casey from North Carolina, and I have a king or a singer for you today. I am currently single and out in the bars looking, and my wing woman happens to be my best friend, my sister, who's 33 and married. Her husband found upon, frowns upon her coming out with me and being my wing woman. So I guess king or sing it, coming out to the bars when you're married. And shout out to you, Eric. I love you. Aww. Woo, 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 woo. Yeah. He's not here. Yeah. I think, um, I think that she seems friendly and yeah, pretty. She seems, yeah, she yeah. seems like a lovely, fucking sweetheart. Lovely. She does. She does. This is the problem. I, I, I'll tell you right now. She has an ass on her. I'll tell you but, right but now. But this is the this is the problem though. <laughs> right now. <laughs> but this is the problem though. Uh, you, you don't go to the bars to look for. That's all. Yeah, that makes that, sense. That's the thing. Because she's she's adorable. Yeah. yeah, yeah you're yeah. just meeting fucking. You're meeting the fucking guy that ran into you at yeah. the fucking. <laughs> and a, you know and a Nike jumpsuit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're gonna meet dirt bags at the bar. Yeah. Where yeah. should she go? Like Whole Foods? I don't know. Fucking I Barnes said, and Noble. I mean, Why yeah. Just say it like that. Whole somewhere. Foods. Yeah. Whole somewhere. Foods. Just walk around. There's so many hoes at you Whole know? Foods. <laughs> yeah, I know. Go to Target. Well, no dudes get fucking. You know. At Target, yeah, yeah, there's only married Some weirdo dudes at Target. Like me yeah, yeah, looking yeah. at the toys or something yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Cleaning up the new GI Joe's. <laughs> yeah. It's me. It's me buying a three in one body wash. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I thought she said, wasn't that kind of from For, the aspect of her sister? Yeah, married husband? sister. I mean, yeah, man. I'm with him. <laughs> it, 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 it depends how many times this is going on. <laughs> yeah, if is she, it if every it's not Friday, like, yeah. and also if she's like on the bar, fucking dancing, I'd be like, all right, listen, you're yeah. not, you're not out there for your sister, really. Right, right, her sister right. goes the day before. She's like, I'm scouting for you. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I'm laying the groundwork for these. Yeah, doors. She's not even with you. <laughs> I had to check out the appetizers. See yeah, what it was like. You got to make sure she's okay <laughs> because um, over a long, t you know, a longer timeline, eventually. Something's gonna happen. Something possibly could happen. Mm. You know what I mean? Could be two dudes that are perfect. Whatever. A couple of drinks are going around. <laughs> yeah. People start making mistakes. They say you spend enough time in a barber shop, you end up getting your hair cut. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. That's gonna happen. <laughs> That's a great. Did you just make that up. That's good. No, Did you just make that up? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> it was in the story. I was gonna tell it. Yeah. You fucking idiots. You missed it. Uh, no, it's an AA thing. I think. <laughs> yeah. So my uncle tells me. <laughs> 
I don't know. Where do you go to? Oh, sorry. To meet to meet uh, like people. I mean, yeah, like, like but but really Chris it's, said, it's, she's it's online. Apps. It's online yeah. dating yeah, is now, the big thing. I, I just think. I mean, are you going to meet also, someone of quality there, though? I don't know. I think so. I not mean, in a bar, though, right? Yeah. How's a bar different than DMs, though? So imagine do DMs you did. Well, you, because you can sift through and like, but and, like and figure out what. At a bar, there's fucking six dudes there, and yeah. they're just like, hey. I mean, mate, what do you? Maybe or the guy's same thing. He's there. He's like, I don't want to be out, man. He runs to the herd. This big Bro, what ass. Is this, a fucking John Cusack movie. That's yeah, not what this it is. This isn't crazy, stupid love. <laughs> yeah, all right, I'm not here. I, I didn't even want to be here either. There are animals right? out there. Uh, are, I mean, what are you guys what, watching? Uh, the what? Purge. <laughs> I mean, what? it's a bar. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it! It wasn't a bar in Star Wars. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ! <laughs> it's in a nice place. All right, this guy's. Uh... What's up, King and Sting fam? I got a. Everyone's morphing into Theo. Y'all, no, these guys' faces don't move. College baseball. Oh, watching it? Oh, no, absolutely not. Let me know what y'all think. <laughs> gang, gang, buzz, buzz. This guy's so bored. Yeah, that's He sent a submission was like, fuck it. What was, I, I couldn't really have a, What was the question? Uh, college. King it or Sting it, it's the topic we, or like, good or bad. Watching, watching, college, watching baseball. college baseball. No, I respect it. I have a, a the different The TV take outside on this. hooked up like that's pretty trash. Yeah, yeah it's a tough that. look. <laughs> Get a I, wall mount, will you? I, the glare. I want people to be playing for money. Yeah. Otherwise, I don't care. Really? Well, those guys are yeah. trying to play I, for money, right? I, I know, but it's like uh, you can't get contracts in a in a. They're, you're, they're playing in hopes of getting a paycheck. Yes. One day. But most of the good players are drafted from high school. To yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, I got gotcha. you. So these guys is tough. Oh, I see. Unless you're yeah. just a super ball. Right, right, right. Yeah, I, I play for money. I want to see those guys play for Dude, money. I, no I, college football. No college nah, basketball. Nah. He don't watch any sports. Nope. Really? Baseball, no sports. I'll, I'll go to baseball games sometimes, because but with with my family and stuff because they you know people are like, but baseball is boring. I'm like, that's exactly why I want to go because they take breaks and shit. What about yeah. the Lakers game? You don't go? No, it's too fast. He doesn't pace. watch any sports. Nothing. <laughs> too what, too what's your joke? Pace. What's your joke if you get caught wearing another man's jersey? Yeah, they yeah, yeah, yeah. That's you? so weird. Yeah, they get to fuck you. That's so weird to have a fucking like LeBron jersey on. That's another dude. Yeah, <laughs> especially as you get older. Like it's, yeah, I it's, wear them all it's the different. Time. But yeah. I, you know, I don't wear a player. I just said the the back's blank. Ever since but you that's said good. that, the back's yeah, just that's blank. fine. But that's yeah. good. It'd be worse Unless if you put your name on it. That's a bad look too. That's that's even worse. You pay for the custom embroidery. That's depressing. Yeah, that's depressing. Sad. That's yeah. bad. Yeah, yeah. things don't work out for you. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, the other day, I was waiting for this fucking uh, big boxing match on ESPN. It says, "Sorry, the boxing match will be aired after this college women's softball game." You're kidding? Oh. Me. It's like, dude, there's seven they got viewers. The TV rights, what, what are we doing? Wow. You didn't play any sports in high school or anything? I played basketball a little bit, and then I was like, what am, what am I going to do? Like, he did some gonna... jiu-jitsu. He, I did do jiu-jitsu. He, he was after, in yeah. a theater class singing and mm -hmm, stuff. Mm -hmm. There you go. Yep. Sing for him. <clears throat> well, like I hit those mayo, mayo, mays. Yeah, do that. Mayo, mayo, may. You know what I mean? I See? can feel it. But pretty I don't. <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> but my mom, my, my mom, every time I even like do joking singing, she's like, you know. And I'm like, ma. She's like, you could have been as. I'm like, I made it. Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? Uh -huh. <laughs> no, she, but she's saying you could have been the, like the next Michael Bublé. You Josh know? Groban, yeah. Yeah. What plays did you do in high school? Oh, man. Do you remember? Yeah, I mean, I did a lot of music. Look over, he's got like, a skull in his hand. <laughs> <laughs> name, name a play. Oh, let me think. He's got a cape on. He's all well. <laughs> what plays did I do? <laughs> well, I'll tell you, Foley. <laughs> a South Pacific shit like that. I never, Oklahoma? I did. So I did. No, I didn't do those. I did um, Little Shop of Horrors. I did. Greece. Greece, I did. Did you? Did you play Danny? No, I played uh, Kaniki. What? Yeah, I know. Yeah, I played Kaniki. Yeah. You tried out for Danny, though, didn't you? <laughs> I actually don't remember. I, I, you I, did. Foley played the car. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I was Thunder Road. <laughs> I don't remember. I, mean, I think maybe I maybe I, I did Kaniki because I wanted to not... You he almost it. slipped into it right there. Did you see that? Well, you got to read You got to read Holy shit. Because I didn't want... Because it's good. It's getting I don't tight know what I'm switching in and out. I can't tell you that. But, it's just um, so naturally <laughs> true. You know what I mean? Um, I see colors. <laughs> <laughs> I just, Start slate. I don't want to do like... You, you, if you play, if, when you play the lead, you got to be... It's like so much work. You know yeah, you don't mean? want that. Oh, dude, so get much the play. Yeah, get the play. What are you doing? You went in there and you blew the audition. No, I'm not. You owned it, dude. Your mother was awesome. right. Yeah. Own it, dude. Yeah. yeah. No, I didn't get a lot of parts though. But he's like, I, I didn't want to play the lead, man. No, 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 no. I didn't mind being oh, one of the pink ladies. You know, it's cool. It really makes me. No, I, I just it fucking. Well, you we're talking about like a. It was like Glendale Community College, bro. It's not like I was in a fucking Broadway. No you know? big deal. 
He Who's wanted it. I can tell you what yeah, he's he's Come on, it. dude. Well, you just try to tell your story. <laughs> <laughs> so there I am. It'd be awesome if you self-produced your own production of Grease. <laughs> oh, my God. I forgot. He's a, Foley's a really good actor, and he did an off-Broadway play. Like, not... I mean, this was... We were, like, really... Mm -hmm. Like, still day jobs mm -hmm. and everything, and he got this off-Broadway play. First of all, it was, it was the first... in Connecticut, all right? It was, <laughs> it was, for, yeah, it was like, real, yeah, real way off-Broadway. Off Broadway. Yeah. Dude, he shows up. I meet him to do a spot. At, like, we're both on the same show at a club, mm -hmm. and he's... Yeah, I literally... Oh, the, yeah. the, after the first day rehearsal i meet him on the street in like fucking april and he's got a scarf around his neck i'm like dude suck a fucking dick fucking i'm not hysterical. talking to you while you have a scarf take the off. scarf off dude. Well, i, I didn't go. talk to you because i had to rest my voice <laughs> chris knows, chris knows knows talking talking fucking Margo I Red. <laughs> well, he's all, i've changed man. Uh, he's things got glasses on it's nighttime like, yeah Dude, then I went to this. He's like Johnny Depp. Yeah, I didn't even. I, I he just told me. I thought it happened in sp space the whole time. <laughs> I thought it was set in space. It was really just set in like 2040. But that's how bad it was. I thought it was on another planet. Amazing. Fellas, we fucking love you, man. Thanks for we having love us. Both you this guys. was a Thank blast. You, man. Yeah. yeah, it was fun. You guys Podcasts were great. So are, much fun. Are you garbage? <clears throat> and there's Patreon, mm -hmm. free episodes. Free, we do two free episodes. They're so week. fun, man. Thanks. Yeah. That's and awesome. then touring wise, where are you guys at? Uh, we are all over the place. We're going to be in uh, Pittsburgh, Buffalo, Detroit, uh, Portland, Seattle. What, what spots you play? Like what kind of spots? We just do one nighters at the oh, club. Okay. We go oh, in during nice, the week, cool. like Tuesday, Portland, Wednesday, yeah, Thursday. Helium. Yeah. Helium, Great yeah, club. yeah, yeah. I'm there this weekend. Yep. Um, yeah, love those heliums. Uh, yeah, we're all over the place. Check it out. We have where, all. Where of can our they get up. tickets? Um, fucking at the club. <laughs> I don't no, know. but like a website. <laughs> uh, we don't have a website. Wow, oh wow. Like, <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. These guys are mysterious. Yeah. yeah you, guys, you, you, send, you know, if you, you send a self addressed stamp down. <laughs> <laughs> no, we have everything we'll on our, we have a link tree. Yeah, yeah everything's just you on always like, forget oh, that. We got a link tree. Link tree, yeah. That's what I don't know the fucking link HTTP. Tree. You, yeah. know you got get everything them, there. You got the merch, you got everything. everything. Uh, it's all in our little bios. I'm announcing uh, I'm gonna be in Grand Prairie, Texas. I'm gonna be in it's a Dallas place. So I'm gonna be in Dallas and Wichita, uh, Kansas. And Lakeland, Florida, I, I um I announce I'm announcing today. So chrislea.com and then Atlanta, Washington, DC. I'm gonna be in uh Denver and a bunch Daddy of Daddy got some places. big theaters Boston. coming up. Yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. I added another one at the Wang, Proud so you, that's man. awesome. Wang Thank in you. Boston? Yeah. All right, be cool, man. Yeah, well, uh, okay. Well, I'm not Chris. I will be in uh, Portland at the Helium this week, Thursday, Friday, Saturday at Portland. Helium, those tickets are damn near sold out. And then San Francisco uh, Cobbs Comedy Club is next week. That's Friday, Saturday that's only. That's a big place. Two shows uh -huh. Friday, two shows yeah. Saturday. Then just added for the Trash Panda Summer Tour, Fort Wayne, Indiana, July 14th through the 16th. San Diego, California at the Laugh Factory, San Diego. Great club. I opened for you oh, there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Your boys headline there. That, that club's awesome. Yeah, it's in the heart of San Diego. That's July 21st through the 23rd. And then I end the summer tour in Baltimore, August 4th through the 6th. Tickets at thickboy.com. But Portland, I will see you this Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Love you guys. Are you garbage boys? Kevin. Foley, Thanks. we fucking love you. Thank, Thank you so you much. Keep doing your thing, man. Don't Thank change. You, man. We love you guys. Yeah. We're out. It's the king and the sting. Back up in the sting. I just got a call that said they want to act the wing. They got me working OT all night long. How many times I got to make this song? Hey, hold on. What is this? Now y'all want to switch? I'll just add a CB and Eric and they all out in Chris. How's that going to fit? Wait, I get the gist. I just probably have to slow it down and hit it like this. It's the king, the wing, and the stink. Now, oh, it's the wing and the king and the stink. Now, hold on, hold on. Hold on, wait a minute, let me think. It's the king and the sting and the wing. Let's go. King and the sting and the wing. Brought it full circle and put on the whole team. Legendary trio, Brennan, Chris, and Theo. What you mean? You know it's the king and the sting and the wing.